Here's a very early Victorian pine bureau. So it's got two drawers and very slightly tapered legs. You can see it's not exactly straight, which is part of the charm. It's got carrying handles that have been added that on the sides there. And then, sorry, I'll do it so you can see. So that folds back and then you've got these very beautiful internal drawers with decorated fronts. Lovely patterns on them. So that's really special. And then there's also something very strange that happens in that the whole top on, I'll just try and do this on my own. So the whole top lifts up. Like that, it's had new hinges fitted at the back. So you can see that totally lifts up. Now why exactly that is, I can't tell you, but the drawers do actually lock themselves. So there's these little turn buttons that stop the drawers from opening. So I guess you can lock the drawers up. And I suppose nobody would really think to actually open it. So they're locked. And nobody would actually think to um, sort of lift the whole, up, whole lot up to open the drawers. I guess that's what it's for. Uh, it's had a new lock fitted there. Which seems to be working okay. Yeah, that's okay. So yeah, very interesting piece of furniture. Um, oh, I'll just show you the back as well. So it is a rustic piece. And what I've done, the, uh, first of all, the code number G1752C, the price 400. If you'd like to buy it as it is, it'll be 400 pounds. Um, I could sort of just go over, give it a once over with a wax finish, just to freshen it all up a little bit. And that would be 447. The height, 36 inches at the highest point. That's up to there, 36 inches. The width at the widest point is 28 and the depth, 21.